Hi, this is Sahana. Welcome back to Entity Framework Core Series. In our today's session, we are going to understand what are domain classes and how to create them. Domain class or a model is nothing but a class that represents real world entity. If we take example that is employee management system, we usually deal with various information like employee, manager details, employee address, employee salary and many more. If we have to represent them in object oriented system, we create class that represents these entities. We call such class as domain class. In this application, I'll create a folder by name models. Right click, add, new folder, name it as models. Let's start creating domain classes. I will add a class by name employee. Right click, add, class. I will name it as employee. To this class, I will add the properties that will describe employee. First property will be employee ID. Shortcut to create properties, type prop, then press tab twice. I will name it as employee ID. Same way I need employee name. Type of employee name will be string. I will add one more property which is of type string and I will name it as AMP last name. Same way we can create other domain classes. This time I will add class and name it as manager. Manager will have manager ID, manager first name and manager last name. In our application, employee and manager are domain classes. For now, let's keep it simple. Later, if necessary, we can add more domain classes. To work with Entity Framework Core, just creating domain classes is not sufficient. We have to create data context class, then even set up relationship and we can do lot many things. We will learn them in our upcoming sessions. Thanks for your time. If you have subscribed to my channel, thanks for your support. If you are not, do consider subscribing to my channel. Thank you.